She's laughing at my lips. I don't wanna go this under. You're gonna get soaked. Just walked around for a while and waited. Yeah. I think we're gonna end up spending half the day here. And then you can move your sleeves up. I feel like I'm in a store. They have these new boats and they're all electric now. 60 to 80 percent of a full charge. Nothing compares to in person it, up close. It is so much different. There's so many beautiful things to see. We decided not to do that though today. Adrian's custard and beef. Medium hamburger? Small hamburger. Gluten free bun. Yum. All right, Adrian's. It's called Adrian's Custard and Beef. She's laughing at my lips. It says it looks like I have lipstick <laughs> on. The chocolate peanut butter is different. Yours is custard. I'm not sure if mine's yeah. custard or not, but it's mine's more hard packed. Yeah. And it's very good. But I don't know about yours. I don't know where you got. <laughs> Cutting to the chase today. We're going to Niagara Falls. <laughs> but first, we gotta mail some fudge from Mackinac Island <laughs> to our son, daughter-in-law, and grandkids. Not the grand puppies. They can't have chocolate. I know we're going somewhere. are wild, aren't they? Like the force they I have. I know. Very kind of scary. <laughs> kind of exhilarating and scary at the same time. Beautiful day, my goodness. Oh, it's the best I, day that we've had all week. We've been really lucking out. Mid 70s it, it, today and like very low humidity, which has been very hot and humid all week. I'm a little bit nervous, I have to admit. Me too. <laughs> Going I don't know why, really. On the boat, it's obviously safe. Well, I don't think this boat goes under the well, falls. I mean, no, it's really close. close. Yeah, we're gonna get wet, for sure. Even though they give you a poncho, all the reviews say you're gonna get soaked. So. Yeah. I did bring some rubber bands. I think you're gonna see gonna rubber put, shoes. <laughs> to put around our sleeves, just uh, on the ponchos to keep water from going up that way because depends on where we go the it gets really windy from the force of the of the water yeah and it goes up all crevices <laughs> <laughs> and crevices. uh yeah so At the stop sign turn left that should help then we just need to keep our hood tight i think i saw like online that i had some ties to tie it but I did bring some little clips just in case. We did bring our old flip flops to wear on the boat and then um, hopefully we can park close enough to where we can go back to the truck and kind of make some changes if we need to. Yep, true story. But I don't know, we're in a really long line right now, I think, yeah. just to get into the parking lot. We didn't, the reason why we didn't come too early is because of the way the sun is in the morning and you're on the boat, with the camera, the camera would be facing the falls and the sun. We kind of wanted to wait until the sun went over a little bit so that the sun would be casting more against the falls and get a better, a better video, a better picture. At least that's what I'm hoping for. So this girl that's walking right now, her backside is completely wet. <laughs> yes, she is. Yeah. Oh, she's got the sandals on that they give you for... Um, oh, Cave of the Winds. Cave of the Winds. We're not sure we really want to do that. That one, it looks like you absolutely get soaked. Like you are un like underwater soaked. Yeah, it doesn't so. look like the ponchos helped. <laughs> so I don't necessarily want to get that wet today. Plus, I don't want to get all my makeup on. Oh, yeah. Messed up. Come on, get a move on over here. How's that go again? I don't know if I can do it again now. Hey, ah, hey, what? What? 
However, the bad thing about coming later <laughs> is you might have a hard time finding parking. Right, close. So we probably should have came earlier, parked, but not went, and just walked around for a while and waited yeah. to secure our parking spot. So we got parked, but on the weekend, you definitely, uh, the parking prices go up on the weekend. And, and that includes Friday. <laughs> yeah, Friday is included on the weekend. Um, so the state park parking, that fills up really quick. We did get in there our first night we came, got a really good spot, and we just came down to check it out. And uh, we're glad we did, because yeah. that was pretty. So now, we had to park somewhere else because most of the lots were full and then a lot of the parking garages have a six foot seven inch height limit couldn't park in there <laughs> so we found a place and it was 30 bucks <laughs> so we uh the first night at the state park it was uh i think 15 yeah 15 dollars there and uh so you look around there's 20 dollars 25 and 30. and it's and they were we were lucky to find what we did yeah we drove around and drove around and it's uh for 24 hours so i mean if you if you are planning on spending the day around here i mean yeah. it's a little bit justifiable mm -hmm. but not really it's still yeah. expensive reminds us of san francisco oh my god the giants game that was 40 dollars to park at the giants game <laughs> that was crazy all right well we're gonna see what time we can get into the uh what was it called made of the mist made of the mist we stopped at this little place back here. Little pizza joint. Mario's. And Mario's Pizza. It wasn't too bad. I had a gluten-free pizza. It was actually pretty darn good. Yeah, mine was pretty good. Lots of traffic. This park is pretty beautiful too. Like I said, we came down here. That was Sunday night, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. On a Sunday and walked around. Sunday it was nice. Yeah. And then it got rainy and hot and humid. Well, really and then it's nice again. Yeah. So we got pretty lucky. That's the visitor center over here. We need to go that way. And then we can get our tickets to the right of that, or the right side of that for uh, Made of the Mist. Niagara Falls State Park. So the visitor center is right back there. Stay to the right. The tickets are over that way for Made of the Mist. My goodness. This line zigzags. Way down there. Zigzags around. Comes back. Goes down. Just to get your tickets. Somewhere between 120 and 125 is when we got in line. We're going to see how long this takes to get through. Hello. Hi. Two? Two is be 50 50, please. Can you just go with any of them now? Or? You can go anytime today before 7 15. Okay, thank you. And it took, we figured, about 30 minutes to get our tickets from that long line that we were in. But it was moving pretty quick. And now we're still in a line. <laughs> yeah. With the masses. They say once you get your tickets you can actually come at any of the boats you can get in line at any time but try getting out of here is that a baby bird How many? Mm -hmm. All righty. Thank you. Yay! Is that a poncho or a parachute? I don't know. Hurry up. I think they're made by glad.
A newborn. Oh my god. <laughs> It like got stuck on my clip. Here. Look. A turtle with a raincoat. <laughs> Put these rubber bands on your sleeve and then you can move your sleeves up so that it's comfortable. You can still move around. Uh, it's a lot more comfortable than having those big flaps hanging down on your arms. Don't get a rubber band that's too tight. But how's yours fit? Good. Should help keep extra water from going inside into your shirt. That's pretty cool up there. We chose to go down below because there was already a lot of people upstairs.
2021, they have these new boats and they're all electric now. And they just sit here and spin 360. They're not loud, you don't hear them. Apparently, we didn't come before, but it's supposed to be a huge improvement. You continue to enjoy exploring the wonder of Niagara Falls and all its surroundings. Please visit us again here on the May the Next. Chargers here. Uh, each of those can put through about 400 amps. Um, Chug wow. in the boat for about seven minutes between each ride. Seven minutes? Does that fully charge it? No, it'll only give us about 20% of the full charge. Uh, wow. It's about what one ride takes out of the boat. It'll keep us between 60 to 80% of a full charge. It's usually where we try to sit most of the time. Cool. got wet at all no. so I don't know if the rubber bands helped feet do get wet so but they're dry now already because yeah. we wore flip-flops nothing compares to in-person up close never nothing. does but this is like the biggest difference that this in the Grand Canyon yeah make the biggest difference between video and in-person vacations and uh, some of the places that we've been we're pretty sure we would have been like oh we got to go somewhere just a little bit better than that because we got a week of vacation you know we got to make the best of it and sometimes we use our other vacation during the during the year for other things like family things or whatever um, you have to you know take little PTO days or whatever it is um, Places like this, like the Niagara Falls, you kind of feel like, oh, I don't know if I really want to go there just for a waterfall. But when you do come, it is so much different. We're going to go back to the truck, change into our tennis shoes, and do some walking around. Yeah, you have tennis shoes. I just have different sandals. Oh, we're hoping to come back in the evening and uh, get a glimpse of the lights. On the Canadian side, they shine the lights on the waterfalls. It's supposed to be a spectacular view guessing it's better from the Canadian side because you can look directly at it, especially Horseshoe. But that's the plan. We just came down uh, right next door to the pizza place we had, uh, ate at earlier. It's a place called Flip Burger. And once again, we forgot to uh, kind of show you what our food looked like, but it's a fast food place. But the burgers are actually pretty good. They didn't have a gluten-free bun, but they had a lettuce, like no bun where they do the lettuce as you're up, and it was still really good. A single is $5.89, a double is $7.89. It's not too bad price. A large fry is $5.99. Regular is $4.79. $4.79 for us, a regular. We've seen people wear everything from uh, tennis shoes, to flip flops, to Crocs and socks.
uh, Three Sisters area. Three little islands. Three. Three. One, two, three. Three. Gorgeous views. It is. Look at these rapids. Isn't that cool? give you the sandals to put on and uh, a lot of them put their regular shoes just right here where on the other side it says a place to park your stroller but we decided not to do that though today right you did too I didn't have a choice uh, whatever Bridal Veil Falls Canada has the lights on. I just want to have my bed right here. Thumbs up. See you next week.